Hey, are you a guy or girl who likes playing challenging games? Or are you one of those pro gamers who think all games are not that hard to play, while the game you see is not even in the list of the most difficult games to play, which in a minute I'll tell you why so sit back and listen. Firstly for a little bit of backstory, I was trying to get my hands on a drone after watching a lot of YouTube videos about drones. But couldn't because I'm broke and can't afford one at the moment. Due to me not being used to giving up, I did some research on how to get the immersion and found out that I can enjoy drone flying in a simulator for PC but I'll need a drone radio which is more priced than my budget and worst case scenario is my laptop though has 8GB of RAM and an SSD, only has a weak GPU that can't run any drone simulator. And so I was stuck on that side. As a result, I had to think of other alternatives. After some research on that one, I found out that I could do drone flying using my Android phone which plays Call of Duty Mobile quite good on the best settings but there was still a problem. Do you know what it is? Well it was that the software is not free. Well, I smiled when I saw the demo of the drone simulator and didn't hesitate to download it. By the way, just wanna say if you love such contents in which I talk about difficult stuff then a sub to the channel will be amazing. So, looking at the review section, it had so much bad reviews but I didn't care since I'm madly in love with drones but my smile was cut short immediately I opened the software or should I say application. The controls were just as bad and annoying I felt that might have been made for Ryanair pilots training. After doing some simple flying and as a complete noob saw no sign of success. I fell asleep and decided to wake up the next morning and try again thinking maybe I was that bad at it because I was tired but nothing changed. As a result, I went online and did another research on why this felt impossible. But found out that it was one simple problem. I was supposed to use a drone controller still. Which is crazy since it's one of the problems why I left the PC version. But wait. I said to myself, why then did they place those buttons there if not for use? Well the text bellow which you see immediately you fire up a new flight is telling you that, this was made to test if the simulator can run on your device so you can buy the actual one and not to be used for training purposes which, no doubt the controls are made so bad. No doubt the drone simulator didn't make it into the list or hard games to play as it literally says demo and also mainly because the developers made it so bad on purpose. By this time, I knew there was no way I could enjoy the sweetness of drone flying since as I said, the drone app is not free and me being broke can't buy simple stuff. As a result, I decided to face my fear and see how long it'll take me to defeat this difficulty and play the game like a pro. If I defeat the game, I get to enjoy the demo and tell you guys subscribe and YouTube has pity on me and buys me a drone. Or. But wait, there's no or, since I don't give up damn it. I started really bad like I was barely able to take off properly without going too high up or crashing. Until after some time, some really long time, like 3 weeks. Take note the 3 weeks is not constant gaming like, I have to sleep don't I? Well after some time, I did it, I defeated this game and though I'm not 100% good at handling this demo, I do pretty good at it and remember I'm using Android touchscreen controls which is not recommended, but since I'm a broke fan of drones, I have to do what I have to do. At this point I was really happy and hey, it took me a total of 2 months to get to this level of gameplay. If you guys wanna try this out to see how difficult it is then the link will be in the description. To end the video, a lesson to take home from this is that let nothing discourage you from your goal. The fact that it seems too slow in progress doesn't mean you are not getting better. Thanks for watching.